What's up everybody, welcome back to Spore. How are we all doing today? We're kind of low to the predator side, so I want to socialize with some animals and do, uh, do that good. Let's go talk to these boys. Let's dance. Nice! And we're almost friends. Alright, we did it. I need to socialize a bit more to get my social status up. Is there another alpha? Not as far as I can see. So let's socialize with him. Dance. Let's sing. Nice. We're becoming friends with these boys. Holy shit. Let's watch out for that. Sing. Nice. That's what. What's that? That's a rogue porco. That's a uh, epic something. Epic. Put him. Put him. Put. Put him up. Uh, Cause he got guns. The mouth. The mouth. Let's see if there's another nest somewhere. No, but there's another epic. Uh oh. Whoa, big chungus? Nice, good charm. And dance. Yay! Another alpha. Let's go socialize with him. That's a pose. Nice. Let's go to talk to this one. What do we perform? Nice charm. Twerk for him. Alright. We've befriended another tribe. Look, it's going up again. We're doing good. Let's go back home. Should I evolve my creature? I don't think so. I think we're pretty much at the perfect point. Here's another nest. Nice. Is there an alpha? Yeah. Dance. A little bit of singing. Epic. We got some more friends. Here's another alpha right next to him. Charm to the top. And we're friends, hooray. Dance. We're the best dancers in the country, man. Whoa. 
What? Okay, let's go back home. And add one more of ourselves to our pack. No! That was not what I meant to do, but whatever. I can upgrade my... Beast. We got some new legs. Let's actually put new legs on here. Nice. And some other feet. That's level 4. Charm level 4. I know we probably have this one. Where is it? Or... Hmm. Ah, these. If I remove these, I can put this on. And that's charm level 4. I think I'm gonna leave it there. A little bit of upgrades. I need another pack member. I am my pack. Let's go, we're back to four. Let's go back to this nest and befriend these people. You are scary, man. And one thing. Now we got it. Now we're good friends with the D Whip. D Whip. Nice. Dance. And we're friends. Let's go talk to this one right away. All right, now we're good friends. I think I need to befriend one more. And then we're the highest of friends with them we can be. Oh, I think that was the wrong one, but... Alright, we're good friends still. And that was our final brain development point. Now, hey, uh, big, big shit breaks the glass. Little celebration. We're tribal now. Congratulations, your brain is fully grown and bur uh, grown and bursting at the seams. Get ready to evolve to the tribal stage. Yes, sir. I am so ready. You've made it to the top of the food chain. When you're ready to give the tribal life a try, click the advance button. Let's do it. Check. Whoa. Did I get those eyes? I think I got to fuck with these eyes. I think I'm not gonna change my creature at all. Maybe take this head off. Yeah. I think it's good like this. Maybe take these off. Just to have it like better. Check mark. Let's get it. What does he do?
start smacking the wood. Nice. Slows a stick in the air. And a fire has been made. Let's go. Now we got a shaman. Congratulations, you're about to enter the tribal stage. Let's go, let's get it. And we got a first hut. With a roof over your head and a fire at your fingertips, you enter the age of to hand tools and drum beats. But be aware, soon rifle tribes will, cr uh, will form across the globe. Be vigilant. Alright. You're now the commander. You now command a burgeoning tribe of three. You may select individual tribe members or a group. To do your bidding, you must interact with other tribes to move your progress bar forwards. Let's take a look. This is your progress bar. You must, uh, you must ally and conquer other tribes to advance your own tribe. All right. These goals will help you guide you through your tribal life. The first task is to dress your tribe in the new tribal outfitter. Click on a hut, on your hut. Click on the head icon to open the tribal life roll uh, over your tribe member and click the added outfit button to enter the tribal outfit. Let's add it. Look at these hats. Actual hats. Nice. Ah, they all have benefits too. Social three. Nice. Maybe add some hair on the two. For combat level one. Actually, I can add this mask and be at combat level a bunch more. Mm, let's actually not. Uh, health level one. Yes. And. Get some knee protection. Health level 2. Nice. These are just uh, random things. And more random things. Alright. So your social level 3, combat level 1. Is there a higher combat level? Gathering. Mm. Let's actually see what the stage is about. I don't know.
You can now move your camera freely around the world. This helps you check in on tribe members or groups whom you have given orders. But let's pause for a moment and learn the basic camera modes. Uh, these controls allow you to zoom and rotate the camera. Your mouse wheel, uh, wheel can also zoom and rotate. Let's try that. Hold the left and right mouse buttons at the same time to pitch and rotate the camera. Ah, right. Got it. Click the icon button on the mini map to focus your camera back on your tribe. Click on the tribe member's portrait in the tribal list, select an individual. Click and drag the book multiple tribe members. I command them as a group. Now that you know the basics, let's begin finding some food. With the tribe members selected, right click a tree to gather food or a wild creature to hunt. Uh, you can go collect food there at the trees. Is it because we have gathering of? Damn, these are big. They're gathering food. Nice. You're gonna hide and add a baby. And we got one baby. And when they grow up, they can also do task for us. Conquer and ally other tribes to progress. Alright. Are there other tribes in sight? Not yet. I think they will appear. Another species has gone to the tribal stage. A rival tribe of Rogar Rogarti has formed on your planet. Alright. The tribal chief uh, leads your tribe. Your tribe can go into combat without its chief, but the chief is necessary for social encounters with other tribes. The chief is also invokes any of your tribe's con consequence uh, abilities. To use a uh, Consequence abilities, first select your chieftain and then click the ability you would like to use. They're all on their way now. Nice. We're befriending them. This also allows you to respond to credit requests and matching buttons. I don't see no buttons. Three. I think that's a cue to leave. Uh, ally Pink Village. Ally the Pink Village by playing music for them. Uh, ally tribes will bring your tribe gifts. Okay. Food and healing instruments. 
Ah, and this is how you get an instrument. Place that down. Nice. Now, if I go check, if I select these. They're all gonna bring some food back. Nice. <clears throat> and get an instrument. Now they have instruments. Let's select them all. Go back to the pink tribe. They come in whistling already. You got the instruments now. Ten out of ten. All right. We're better friends with them now. So when they ask for instruments, you just press the instrument button, and that's how you get on their good side. 10 out of 10 again. Now we're good friends with them. All right. Everybody party. And we unlock some shit through that. Nice. My first part of a totem pool. You've made Pink Village your allies. To celebrate, they have shared a totem piece, as well as new tools and outfits for your tribe. These have been added to your tribal planner. All right. The hut grows a bit bigger. Perfect. Magic. Bigger fireplace. Awesome. Your tribe grows uh, in prestige. You have a larger hut to show for it, and your tribe has now sustained up to nine tribe members. All right, let's go back home. Maracas. Ah, fair. I need more food to be able to build. Let's get another baby. And he can go collect food soon too. We're collecting more and more food. Let's make another baby. <laughs> that guy was just running around and fucking fell down. We got two babies now. They're gonna be playing the maracas when we get enough food to get those. This one has grown up. You can start collecting food too. Or should I make him? What does this do? Make, does it make it a pet? I don't know. I don't really like the look of those creatures. How much health does one have? 110. If you give him a spear, I, uh, I can send him to fight those. Get food. Nice. No. Bang. These two can collect spears. Now they both have weapons. Now we can make them attack. Here, right? Only one more. Collect that up.
Nice. And we got some meat. Oh shit, we're under attack. Attack. I take them back. This is another tribe that started. Pink is over the gift. Press the click the gift basket to accept it. Where's the bis the gift basket? What gift basket? Here? Ah. Nice. What's the gift? How much food? I think it's just a bunch of food, right? Yeah. Everybody can eat and heal up. Nice. And if we now make a couple more babies. So the this cyan village attacked us. So I'm just gonna make a bunch of people and make them all get spears and attack them. I think we can win this easily. Chieftain, head back. Retreat. But the rest of these folks can keep attacking. We can win this. We have lost a couple soldiers, but I feel like we can beat them easily. It takes so long for them to like reload. I think we need better weaponry after this. Or first the Maracas, I think I want to be a mostly social tribe. It's just that these guys started hating us. So, it's the easiest to just attack them back. We are almost out of like tribe members. Oh god. We're under attack. Everybody head back. I need better defense. I think. Fishing spears. Equip the tribe members with fishing spears to maximize their fishing bounty. We're not close to water. So I'm not really... I don't think we're gonna need that anytime soon. We almost died. Go repair this. They're almost dead here though. I really want to kill them off. Maybe just grab two of them. And set them to attack the... Hut. Nice, we can win this. I think this is the last one of theirs left. We can still win this. Get one more to attack. How much wood do we have? We can get two more babies. Nice. I'll select these two. And attack their hut.
One died. Okay, let's retreat. I just need a bunch of food. I want a gift basket. Nice. We got a bunch of food, let's make three babies. I can imagine there's just two fucking creatures in there shagging a bunch. Producing eggs and rolling them out. This is the orgy hut. Another gift basket. Damn, they're very generous. Now that's... Give three of these. Three. Go collect some more of this. And the bottom four. Can go take this tribe. We can win this. Easy. Yeah. This one's almost dead. Nice. Attack them. And now attack the hut. Now I have six of them attacking the hut. Let's go produce another baby. This one. Collect the spear. And you can stay home pretty much. I think we got this in the pocket. They're gonna destroy this. And I got one person at base gaping an eye on there. Besides that, not much. We're almost there. That's one tribe destroyed. Let's go. We got some new stuff from there. Sick. New totem. Bang. You have destroyed the Cyan village. Your tribe has carved the second totem piece to remember this monumental occasion. The spoils of battle are new tools and outfit. Find them in your tribal planner. Alright. Now select everyone. You go foraging. <clears throat> Sick! I actually extinct one tribe. Let's go. Now let's see. Here. Maracas and Digiridus. I think I'm gonna go with the Maracas because we need higher socials. I still wanna befriend most people. Nice! We got a bunch of food. We're pretty sad. So. Next thing I want to do is befriend the Lavender Village. But I think I'm going to do that next episode. If you're watching this on YouTube, like, subscribe, all that stuff. And thanks for watching.